Take a look behind me outside. I'm going to tell you something. It is a dark, dreary day in southeastern Michigan today. I'm not sure if that sun has shined more than once or twice in a month. Listen, it's winter time, and you know, this is the most amazing thing. These clouds just hover in the sky. They don't even have the kindness to just release the snow, so at least it would be pretty and the sun would shine. Yesterday, the sun was shining, and it was like some kind of miracle, some kind of new day. Some days, nothing about our lives are going to be screaming, smile, rejoice, and celebrate. So we've got to know to go to the ultimate source of hope and life and be filled with with the word of God. Have you ever noticed that some of the people who are dealt the worst hands are the happiest people you know? This isn't always the case, but I know a man in Haiti who used to live so despicably poor. And we would tell him, hey, soon we're going to have a men's home built, another Matthew 25 house, and you're going to be the first one to move in. And he would start to dance. And he was so poor. And just a little bit of hope, a little ray of sunshine, he would begin to dance. And he would humble me because I would think, with all that I have, with all that I am, with all that God has blessed me with, why on earth don't I dance with just a little ray of sunshine of hope like this man? Listen to what the Bible says in Deuteronomy 8, 3. He humbled you, causing you to hunger, and then feeding you with manna, which neither you nor your fathers had known, to teach you that man does not live on bread alone, but on every word that comes from the mouth of the Lord. Listen, we need to be encouraged today because God is speaking to us through his word. The ray of sunshine and hope that can give us the excitement to dance. Yeah, something more than excitement. The deep and abiding knowledge that no matter what we're passing through, no matter how little sun is shining, the light of God yet shines in our life. And that alone is enough to give us cause for dancing. Listen, God bless you today. Amen.